Hi guys, welcome to another tutorial. Today we are going to learn how we can be able to create our first Android Studio project. We are going to install, create, and learn an app using Android Studio. So to get started, let's start by downloading Android Studio and installing it. So visit on your browser, type developers.android.com slash studio download and studio agree with terms download for windows if you're using linux download for linux then a next file will download i want to download because i've already downloaded after the download is complete install and let's get started by developing our project so once you install you'll get a panel like this one where you can start a new project open an existing check out project version for last, we're going to start a new project. Then, empty activity. Let's call it my first app. Minimum API level, that is KitKat. You can choose up to or Android Oreo, that is Android 8. You can decide to use Java or Kotlin, save, and then package name. So let's finish. Our project is being created. This is the Gradle file whereby where we add our dependencies. So it's this one. All right. We add our dependencies here. This is the project folder. This is manifest where we create our permissions. We can declare use of internet, camera access, SDK, SD card access. This is the main activity created by default. These are our layout. This is where we add our images and raw files. So to learn our project, hit this button, then select select deployment target for la for this tutorial. I've already created virtual devices. So you can select Nexus 5 API, then click OK. Emulator. Let's see what is in our application main. By default, we have the hello world text. If you want to add any text, you can just drag and drop buttons, just drag. Can call it login. You can put it here. You can have an edit text. You can tell, you can see username. You can have another edit text. For password, you can remove this one. Give it constraint here. Text, you can see password. Give it constraint, then login button. Give this one the ID. 
edit text with the username with the password can call this button login all right let's learn this up and see the output my first app reward as it was in the beginning now we have added username password field and the login button Wow, you can see now you have your username, you have your password, field, and your login button. Stay tuned for more tutorials. Click the subscription button. Thank you for watching.